So you just bought your call or maybe you bought a put option in interactive brokers. But the thing here is that you bought it on the desktop app or on the desktop web, but then you find yourself coming closer to the expiry date. On the desktop and the web, you can only close your position. You can't roll your position. So now how to roll your position? So with that, we have to use the interactive brokers mobile app. On the mobile app, we can roll our options position. Whether it's call or put option, we can roll the position to a lower or higher strike price or to a nearer date or later expiry date. So before we go into the tutorial, if you're new to interactive brokers and you want to sign up for an account, you can use my referral link in the description below. So now we're going to go back to the interactive brokers app, the mobile app. So we're going to look here, and video call option that's set to expire on April 12, 2024. And this call option is $975. So here I'm going to tap my call option. So here we're going to tap roll position and then we'll be brought to the options chain. So I'm going to move back to the original expiry date of 12 April. And then to show you how to roll your position, I'm going to choose the strike price of $882.50. So here the bid price is $17.05. And then the ask price for this call option to roll to is $17.60. So you see here at the bottom, there are two legs. The two legs means the first leg is your original call option contract. And the second leg here refers to your position that you want to roll to. So that's why there are two legs. So you can choose any other date and any other price to roll your position. But here in this video, I'm going to choose this strike price and this date again. So anyway, tap roll position. Then you'll be brought to your order page. So here, put in the quantity that you want to roll, your order type, and then the limit price. So in most cases, depending on how close the contract is to expiry, your contract may be worth very few cents. So to ensure that your order has a higher chance of being fulfilled in the order queue, in this case here, we know that the row position, the ask price is $17.60. Here, we're going to choose a limit price of $18 and then slide slide to buy slider but in this video i'm not going to roll my position but now i'm going to show you how to do for your put option so looking back here at my portfolio here we have 12 april 2024 800 dollars put nvidia so now to roll the position tap it tap the put contract now to roll the position tap the roll position button and then here in the options chain to show you i'm maybe now going to buy and roll it to 880 strike price for the put option and the bid here is $17.40 and the ask price is $17.90 so type the roll position button so again put in your quantity order type and then the limit price and the time in force so let's say you want your put option contract the rolling to be higher in the order queue and higher chance of being fulfilled as soon as possible try to put the limit price as close to the ask price so we know that the limit price was $17.90 so for this example here I'm going to put $18 and then we can slide the slide to buy slider to roll this put option contract but this is just for video illustration purpose I'm not going to roll and even close this position and that's it on rolling options in interactive brokers and using the interactive brokers mobile app I hope you found today's video helpful if you are new to this channel and you like today's video, hit the like button and subscribe to this channel below to stay tuned for more videos like this in interactive brokers or in investing or in finance or in real estate or in home and living products. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video.